the pilgrim met the founders of the House of Enlightenment. Ooh. And so of the Varun. This unit uh, unity mission is Mateo brought me to Keeper Aquilas. His final resting place to live and We're talking the about the unity basically. In contemplation of infinitum addendum. His addition or contribution to the infinite. But what if the story isn't a Yeah, I guess there's a lot of talking involved, but then a way the of finding the pilgrim mission should again, be action packed. Or at least his grave. Very specific. Sounds like the House of Enduring of other parts then. Mm. Yes. Something must be there. I just can't put my finger on it. Maybe the answer will become clear when we have more. The House of Enlightenment and Varun have versions of this story. Why not the talk to them? Work out of the well here I don't think New the Varun people have killed some of them. So I don't think they will actually speak to me. Sure. But there is a lone zealot that was captured recently for attacking UC ships. I visited her a couple of times. Hopefully, she'll be willing to talk to you as well. Oh, let's do it. So, mission status uh, of the mission Unity. Uh, let's see. Talk to the Varun prisoner. This one. Same one, same way. Hey. Okay. Hope we get to fight some spacers or something. Talk to the Varun prisoner. One day House Varun just up and abandoned their embassy. So, let's go and talk to the prisoner first. Spaceport. Nadiston, got a minute to chat? Okay. Mm. Talk to the House of Enlightenment. Uh... I guess let's do this one first because the other one would require me to travel. This one would be in the well, I guess. So let's do this one first. The well, figure it right. The House of Enlightenment. Hey, if you have time, I've been thinking about something. There's a lot of work that needs to be done. Andy Singh. A lot of people in need. If it's about the financial or food assistance programs, we are backlogged. Don't worry, we're doing everything we can. Oh, you're not. Sorry. Can I help you? Regretta sent me. I need to talk about the pilgrim. The Unity Pilgrim in particular. If that rings any bells. Listen, I've talked about this with him a ton of times, and there's no record of a Unity Pilgrim, but since you both insist, our early records are mostly administrative. Humanitarian projects, group counseling notes, charity expenditures. But there is a series of exchanges the founding members recorded in a lot of detail. It's the closest thing I have to what Aquilus is describing. Mm, let's hear it. A man walks into the first house of enlightenment. The founding members just call him the Drifter. So they think he's a charity case at first, but no, the Drifter asked them a bunch of questions. If your philosophy is built on an individual's own morality, 
What about the second person? That second person might disagree. Isn't the problem of two what you're really looking for? And the founders respond, each individual must understand how the second person lifts them up. All of human effort is a story of cooperation pushing us forward. And it kind of goes on like that. He comes back every week for a year. Same conversation every time. Second person this, the problem of do that. Yeah. Honestly, I think the founding members made it all up. There was a little more hesitation being openly atheist in the early days. I think they were experimenting with writing their own scripture. Fortunately, that got abandoned pretty quick. After the records of the Drifter end, you never see anything like it again. Always happy to help. If you'll excuse me, I've got a lot of... Okay. Then... Yeah, let's get out of here and... Talk to the... Is there a mission board here somewhere? By the way, let's get to the prisoner. Spaceport. I think it's on Mars? No? Neon? Oh, it's at the Neon prison, I think. Let's see. Okay. Mm, while I'm here at Merson's Isle, so I needed argon titanium adhesive, at least. And then let me quickly double check first my ammo at the moment. I need some 7.5s. That's it, really. Okay, bye. So, rebels. Uh, she doesn't have ammo. Ask. We'll have some digipix, probably. No digipix. Oh, this is stuff that I can sell. Um, let's buy from her ammo. So I needed seven point five white hot. I don't know if this will actually work. But yeah, let's buy them. And these are usually popular. Faceless. And then also from her, let's buy any aid that we need. Um, from our pack. Aid pack. Hmm. Sorry, I'm doing this kind of as a part of the mission. But yeah, let's hey, we were running low on food stuff. get out of here. Let's go to the spaceport. Oh, I need to go to... Oh, he's right here in the UC prison cells. Okay. That's interesting. I thought I was gonna go to like Neon Prison or something. Okay. Let's look to the prisoner. To report. Oh. Hello? A visitor? Oh look at this um Varun with the dark eyes. He knows not the truth. He sends another to ask more incessant questions. He sent both of us to ask more incessant questions, actually. The Great Serpent waits in the shadows. He will entwine the universe, and all but the faithful will be made as dust. That is the truth. No more, no less. You don't need to tell us. We just figured it would be better to ask you directly than to take a second-hand account of your words. Yes, I have spoken to your keeper about this. I will tell you what I told him, and then you will leave me. Jinan Varun meets the Unbeliever. He gives false prophecy to Jinan, 
But such is Jinan's conviction in the Great Serpent. He does not hesitate. He cuts the unbeliever down. But the unbeliever returns. Jinan realizes the Great Serpent is testing him, and he will not be found wanting. Four times they fight. Over 120 rotations of the planet they are on. Remember these four battles, Jinan, the Unbeliever says. Remember these 120 rotations. But Jinan knows this is blasphemy and delivers the killing blow. That is all. Then we are done. Leave. Let's return to the keeper. Hey, I don't think I can take so. anything here. Oh, I could really listen to Barrett's go. Let's just run it out for now. Got a minute to chat? Quailers. Cool, let's talk to him. And see what he says. Oh, well, you're back. What did you learn? Was there something hidden in their stories? Like we thought? If there really yeah. is a location the Pilgrim wanted us to find, those do sound awfully like coordinates. What else did you learn? Yes. Coordinates. What he added to infinity. Maybe that points to a name. If we're looking for his resting place, we'd need to know the name of the star system, wouldn't we? Was there anything else? But it's a medendum. Hmm. Planets are often named by number. Mm. That second might mean the second planet in the system. Let's see. We have something that could be coordinates. Something that could point to a planet in the system. But what's the name of the system? Infinitum addendum. What if we break down the parts? No systems named finite or add. That just leaves in and dumb. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's certainly how I feel. Yes, that's it. Indum. The second planet Indum. in Indum. At Indum. 4 and 120. That's where you'll find the Pilgrim's resting place. And from there, maybe you'll find the true meaning of unity. Before you go, you've now spoken to many different perspectives in our universe. In a way, you'll be carrying their philosophies with you on this journey. I know you're looking for a specific unity. But... 
If you had to guess what it was, what interpretation would you give it? Ah, but what makes something like that holy? Gravity is also a force that brings things together. Should that be sanctified? Yes and no. We believe God is out there waiting for us in the universe and that the grav jump will bring us closer. But is gravity itself an article of faith? What do you think? And so you think this word unity describes a similar miracle? The processes of the universe are all in accordance with some greater intent. We're talking about unity now, and gravity. I a miracle was something unexplainable and magical. But we know a hell of a lot of... Any other miracles you want to discuss? Well... Hey, Dusty. If you're ever thinking to yourself... Let's go to oh, Indem 2. Really listen to Barrett's dulcet voice right now. Then instead of dreaming about me... Stop by. Let's just head to the frontier, right? Where is it? Uh, that's the street. Got a moment? Doctor, New Atlantis, raise the leaf. Yes. Go to Indus 2. That's the mission. Take off. Do this. What's uh? Let's see what there is to see. Kingdom two. Pilgrims rest. Hello. Do you read me? Mm hmm. Hello there, and thank you for responding to my hail. <laughs> it's been a long time since I had company. I'm Dr. Okay. Sola Banglawala from Mast in New Atlantis. I'm performing a geological survey of the settled system. I flagged you down to see if you might... Hmm. I think I have what she wants. <sighs> I'm going okay. to try my luck in another system. Good luck. Sorry, this is taking longer than... Hello. So, do you have any hope? I really can you believe that. Wow. So you're to pilgrims rest. And land. Let's see what's on this ball. Get up.
my stuff. I'm glad I took the Manta suit back on. Just quickly wanted to basically make sure that I'm not carrying heavy stuff like this. 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 Okay, we're good. I'm up for a little adventure. Two. Let's do this. Pilgrim's Rest. Let's talk. When you have time. Captain Neo. Hello. Uranium. Oh, nice. So, yeah, we got a whole new planet here to explore. There's so many things. For now, we're just gonna follow the mission. Upper. Uranium. Aluminum. What am I hearing? Sorry. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of cool stuff here. Programs writing. Search for clues about unity. Writing five, so I have one and five, I think. Mm. I just want to steal some more stuff, uh, loot some more stuff. But yeah, clues, clues, clues. Any clues? No, just no picks. What's this? Pick of cards. Okay, no clues. Let's. Write answers. 
you will know what question to ask. What is the unity? Answer. Okay, let's have a quick look because I wasn't reading the notes. Mm. The pilgrim, pilgrim's writing one. Humans never cease to amaze me. My worst instincts, the evil spirit, draws towards a form of contempt for them. But I remember them. But I'm privy to that which they're not. I cannot and should not judge them for a lack of vision when I know very well the blinders which obscure their sight. Once wore them myself. After all, hope for their sake that they may say someday understand. But for my sake, I wish to be left alone. And then five. Um, so sure. that's a lot of reading. Imagine continuing on the road, uh, passing through process of a new notable year that road seems gratifying every step. Pleasure seen more contented version of myself in the future. Then, for the sake of considering all this, imagine if I took a different path, if I stopped running, um, stopped seeking to gather my own power. Uh, if I instead embrace the twinges of compassion I feel in my heart and let myself care for the people who seem to gather about me wherever I try to work. I simply lived and taught and perhaps brought others to the light and died. That road also seems gratifying. I, I also see a contented version of myself in that future. There is the difference though when I stop thinking about the glories I could achieve for myself, the pleasure fades nearly immediately. More fulfilling. Where do I find the rest of the writing? Let's see. What is the unity? Hmm. Um, okay, wait. So there's got to be more writings. Are they here or... they got to be around here, right? Somewhere. No? Let's see. Yep, writing two. So here's the crux of my troubles. To accomplish anything, I need to work with other people. I need assistance. I need workers. I need hands. As we work together, they never let be asked questions, and I can never help talking. It starts innocently enough. They want to understand how someone who believes or they have their own misunderstanding instilled by some borderline religious remnant. My weakness is my inability to let it alone. I want them to understand. So I try, gently as I might, to nudge their minds along the right path. Then there are follow ups and following the trouble is with these people. If I didn't. So I guess let's find the rest of the writings first before we can actually. Where's the door? Here it is. No? Here it is. Writing four. Writing three. Today, in a soft uh, voice, my assistant asked me if there was anything above the unity. It was all I could do to keep them. People are necessary, but people are madness.
cool. That's good. All just um, kind of scouting for stuff as well, and then there's four. Uh, so I know the answer to me, Matt, at least. Difference, anything else for now? Time to have myself on the ball. No one. I don't like this person. It was writing four, and then I do have writing five as well. And I could build an outpost here, I guess. So now that I have all the writing. Let's try again. What is the unity? Do I necessary? No one. Oh. I didn't do that right. Unlock. What is the unity? Myself. What is in the growing? Stopping in an embracing fashion. The true immunity of unity. If you still wish to find it, there is one final piece of myself in the next room. Find my my own answer for a lot a long time ago, but not in the way I was expecting. I hope your journey gives you the truth. I don't know what the correct answer is, I might never increasingly though. I'm comfortable with the not knowing. The more I reflect on being here, in this world, in this time, the more I think it is precisely where I need to be. This time will be different. It won't be about me, so I won't have to run. I can actually build something with an intent instead of scrambling to fix something that, that others create in my name. It'll be something beneficial. It'll be something beneficial. Again. I'm leaving behind that other person. The world has no place for him. Let him die. Let me live to enlighten the blessed universe before me. You have found the end of my journey, but to know everything must find its beginning. On Hyla 2, the um, island hides the scorpion, and the scorpion sting hides the truth. So we're going to Hyla. Uh, storage box. Uh, increases ballistic weapon damage permanently. Nice. Back with its reactive gauge. Um, what is this stuff? Okay, cool. Let's go to Isla 2. data collection. It's safe, it's smart, it's valuable. Where's it leave? Fast travel. Then we're going to Hyla 2. Mm, take off. Achieved. 
campaign. Far from beyond in them. Um, yeah, I'm just following this mission. Ancient ruins. Find the scorpions thing on Hala 2. The resources. Out of fuel range. It's in the Hyla system. So of course, let's see. Ooh, I need to go past the creeks. Pepper. Damn, I hope I don't have to fight now. A haiku. It sounds like something was here. Okay. It's called space. <coughs> space is cold and dark. Starships fly there like comets, carrying us home. It's Isla too. Yeah, I can get to this bugger. Another one right there. Fuck. Nice. Oh, I can actually kill them now. Ancient ruins. Let's land. Let's fight this out. Level 35 now. Landing commencing. And I think we're gonna battle a bunch of those, like, star. What are they called? Okay, exit ship. Oh, uh, but this is not highlight too. Oh well, I guess it is. Those are starborn wounds. You see that, right? Yo, things a little bit hectic. I'm just surveying as well while I'm at it. 
Yeah, and these guys are not doing anything to me, so... I mean, why ruin the beast? Nutrients. Roots. Oh well. We'll survey it later. Oh. Look at this. this Wondering if that means I've replayed, and you need to know that you. And if it had been me, ah, oh, he's just talking to me. I know. And I, I don't know if you're, but I just want you. I'm not sure that I am. Of course, we are. When a star goes nova, the galaxy. Still doesn't make it easy. But you did what you had to do. Andresha was a... I can't say I... She knew who her... Yes, though so, uh, You know, we're fortunate. If we're going to set things... Yeah, I don't want to talk to him now. I wanted to move... The light... It's supposed to... Be on something... And it's probably there. Or in the middle. You know? Go to the last star of the constellation. Oh, so I need to go. Do I need to go through every star though, or go to the last star of the to go through the steps. I think I'm supposed to go through all of these steps.
Uh, I see. Okay, I already did it. Be cool. It's part of the mission. Sources into the ship. Man, the galaxy is too big to be stuck in the And let's find the lost star in the constellation. Feeling there's gonna be more ships to fight. Let's see. But it's good for the piloting experience. Okay, no, nothing. Let's see. Dead course. Too far, but I can go to Parima. Yeah, and then from here, I can jump there. jump modulating hunter haha <laughs> and you in their footsteps okay so that's it for unity and then this in their footsteps starts so I'm gonna stop this recording